Hello everyone, in this video we are trying to talk about reducers in Orthogen, uh, reducers, uh, aggregates, data or data structures in Orthogen. Uh, the data structures uh, or data can be images or bands, uh, image collections, features and feature collections. Uh, for this purpose we use ee.reducer and reducers work for the statics such as minimum, maximum, uh, mean, standard deviation, uh, and they can be complex such as uh, histogram or for the linear regression. And reducers requires inputs and outputs. Uh, that is, uh, it needs the input data sets and it generates the output according to it. Um, they can be single input reducer applied to the multiband image, uh, which is applied to each and every band. Um, in that case, the output and inputs uh, have the same number of bands. However, there can also be other types of reducers uh, using multiple inputs, uh, but the inputs are not applied to all the bands, um, such as the uh, linear regression, ee.reducer.linear uh, uh, regression. Uh, some of the types um, of the reducers also can generate multiple outputs, so uh, the reducers can work in very different ways. So here we have the very first code. Uh, we have loaded and filtered the Sentinel-2 image collection. And it has been used for minimum and maximum value. And we can print that. And um, the example of uh, codes, this code produces two types or uh, two different um, outputs, uh, the results are appended with minimum and maximum values. Uh, we will see that later. And the other important thing to note is that the output and the competition should match. Uh, for example, uh, image collections needs to needs, needs the reducers uh, with the numeric outputs uh, because they deal with the pixel values. And the reducers uh, for the image collection like two list and histogram won't work. And also the uh, maxed pixels if we have marks, the pixels are not used in the competition process. And here is another example. Uh, this example here is uh, combining uh, two different reducers. And this is helpful for uh, efficiency. Here we can see here, we have ee.reducer.mean. And here we, com uh, we, here we write the dot combined. And after that, we have uh, ee dot reducer dot standard deviation two different reducers and that had been uh, that has been uh, further done by image dot reduce region and we have reducer and the previously defined reducers has been applied here so two different reducers are working together and the inputs here yeah, here we have the shared inputs and this has been set as true, and this results in passing the data over time. So the two different users will work in the same data. And image collection um, reductions are uh, also useful in our uh, This is done by image collection dot reduce, and the collection of the images are uh, worked on the individual pixels. So uh, in the image collections, we work on the, the reducers work on the uh, individual pixels and static such as uh, minimum, maximum, uh, mean or uh, median can be done here. Um, the reducer uh, is applied to each and every band and the median has uh, the median or something. If the if something is done, then the result is in, in the result in the console, you can see uh, it by underscore and the uh, something uh, the computed value. So here we have uh, ee dot reducer dot median. So this is the uh, collection here, and we have uh, calculated the median or computed the median. And uh, images can also be reduced similar to the image collection, uh, which is done by image dot reduce. And here we have um, the here we have the reduction done for the maximum value, 
And here the important thing to note is bands are the input uh, for the images. So not the images are used for reduction. So if we run them all, we want to see from the very beginning here, here we had the minimum and maximum value. If we see here in the console, we can see uh, the bands have been doubled by minimum and maximum value for each of the band. So uh, as mentioned earlier, there is a underscore minimum, uh, min underscore max. So this is the, the um, name has been changed by appending uh, underscore min and underscore max. Similarly, the second one was the stats. Here we have the two different values similar to the previous one, but here we have underscore mean, underscore standard deviation for each and every bands. And the next one was for the median now. And this is the median here. And we have underscore median. Uh, the name has been changed with underscore median. And this has been done for each and every band. So this was done by ee.reducer.median. And finally, uh, the last one was the uh, maximum value uh, that was drawn for the a single image. So here the uh, maximum value has been used uh, from that image. So as for the layer, uh, we have two different layers. Um, so you can see here, this was the layer and maximum value image. So this was it. Um, uh, reducers, uh, to summarize, reducers are uh, very much important to be able to uh, generate the value. And for this is all for the statical competition. Um, so this is it uh, for this video. I hope this was helpful. Thank you for watching.